Hey guys, before we get into it, I want to take a quick moment to acknowledge the growth the channel has received. I truly appreciate it, so thank you to all the new subscribers, and the old ones too. You guys are the OGs. While I do have the topic lined up for the next dissection video, the UBT was in need of some updates, as a few publications have since been released. Now normally I don't make videos for UBT updates, but this one, I think, is a bit special. And so I deemed it worthwhile to do a quick showcase. But first, a quick explanation on what is the Untitled Battle Tracker. The UBT is a score tracking app I made for PC to help track and display the values for both players' objective and command points for games of Warhammer 40k. What separates it from its contemporaries is that I designed the UI with readability at a glance in mind, and its layout lends itself well to a scoreboard-style aesthetic. Plus, when the battle is done, there's a nifty visual representation of the scoring distribution, as well as some graphs showing how VP and CP were gained and spent. Now onto the updates. To kick things off, I've updated the GT secondary selections to reflect the current 2021 mission pack. I've also added the unique subfaction secondaries for the Adeptus Mechanicus and the Sisters of Battle. Like with the other 9th edition codexes, when playing as those factions, those secondaries become available options. Now onto the good stuff. While the UBT served to help players track and display their scores in games of 40k, it became clear that it was also useful to content producers as well, so I have added multiple features that tie together to allow the UBT to further serve that end. To start, I've added a compressed mode to the score tracking, compiling all of the relevant victory and command point values along the top of the screen, sort of like a status bar user interface. Next is that the background can now be toggled for chroma keying, which allows the app to easily overlay onto your footage. Here's an example. We will, the truck has sped around here, ready to ram those girls in the rear. Well, it works great. In the collapsed view, all the values can be updated and modified using the same hotkeys as the detailed view. And to add a little bit of icing on the cake, I added a simple animation to handle the transition between the compressed and detailed views. Lovely. It's pretty simple to set up. I've composited this footage here using OBS, with the settings shown on screen. There are a few additional updates as well, that include the adjustment of some hotkeys and the inclusion of a changelog. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. And a special thanks to my patrons, Julius Maximus, as well as the others who help keep the dream alive. You can find the latest version of the UBT on my webzone, link in the description. Give it a download and please let me know what you guys think, and if you encounter any bugs. So, if you enjoyed this video, there is a like button. And if you want to help my channel grow, there is a subscribe button. There is also a bell button and a share button, so press the buttons you want to press. And with that, I hope to see you guys in the next one. And that brings us to next week's community post. What do you have for us, Jan? After an edition's worth of placing the primaries on a pedestal of superiority, we are finally going to do right by our customers. It will be a sure hit. Oh ho ho, I'm excited. Go on. We're going to announce that all Space Marines will be getting improved to the two wound standard. Lie.